The weather for the next couple of days was looking bloody good, so I loaded up the stabby craft with all the gear to target a variety of species as we'd entered into the high pool fishing comp. First up was a deep water drop for Harpoka, as Laura has been trying to catch her first one for a while. This wasn't on the species list, so it was a quick few drops and then off the target snapper for the evening. How do you feel? You got your first poker? Yeah. Oh my god! That really hit me, aren't they? Shit, that really hit me. Oh my god, I knew determination would get one. Oh, we've arrived, finally, at Doodle. It's a little windy. It's all right. It's going to get better and better tomorrow. It's a bit of a gas station. It's all right. Literally just turned the camera off and I'm hooked up. Oh, no, you just leave it on. Oh, because I was like, this is... Oh, I've got the music cranking. Jeez, I, I'm not playing. I had no faith that I was, was going to hook up with the foot, you know. First drop, first drift of the trip, and we're hooked up to. I'll call it a snapper. It's doing all the snappery things. <laughs> well, use my words. The snapper head nods then. It's not going to be a record breaker though. Fish of the trip. That will look, oh, look at the sunshine. You look really good. Me, I am a bit burnt actually. Oh, there we go. Oh, oh it's because there's too much drag on it. Back, thank you. Oh, 
Another bloody boat has just turned up to a spot. Oh no, I can't swear. Another boat has just turned up to a bloody spot. And he's right on my damn drift line. First world problems. He turned up right as we were pulling in two snappers too, so that doesn't really help. No, it doesn't. It wasn't like we could hide that we were hooked up either. He's literally come right in. Oh, we don't hook out this drift, are we pissed? What an epic evening session this was, landing a couple of nice groper and catching and releasing a few snapper. As the sun went down, they soon went off the bite, so it was time to head into the mooring and cook up some fresh fish for dinner and then get some rest before an early start tomorrow. John Dory. We'll get a bit of footage of this. start to the day this was. After losing a few kings early on, we managed to land a nice John Dory in Trevella. So, it was now off to target some big blue cotton. But, did this go to plan? Having a 
just gonna get off the bottom. This is not the rod to be fighting a <laughs> kingfish on. Well, as we've already found out. Yeah. And we're, I was only like five meters in. Oh, not again. Should have dropped a jigging rod. I think so, yeah. Oh, this rod is not made for this sort of fight. Stop there. It's going under. We'll go back and jig for that, eh? <laughs> Right here. Is he? Yeah. Oh, no, they're right there. Can you wind that up? Yeah, yeah. I've never felt this fight in my f***ing life from a kingfish. Now I see why people are left handed. That was a good fish. We tried again, but got busted off. And just like that, they've gone off the bite. So it was time to move spots and give them another go. Towing him at the moment. <sighs> yeah. 
chocolate. What a way to end a great trip with a nice 98 centimetre kingfish. It was pretty successful. We ticked off a few species for the comp, but I was still pissed that I couldn't land one on the surface. But this just gets me excited to be back out again on Naughty Boy to target those surface kingfish. As always, thanks for watching. But if you want to keep up to date with my latest fishing adventures, subscribe to my channel or go and check out my Instagram.